So you just got your DJI Osmo Action 4 camera. Congrats, it is a really nice action camera. And also we are on the same boat. But the first thing you should do before starting to use the camera in real life is to install a screen protector. Installing a screen protector is very easy, anyone can do it and it will preserve your camera in mint condition for a long period of time. If it breaks you can replace it and this also preserves its resale value for when it's time to upgrade to the Action 5 maybe. This box here contains two sets of screen protectors for both screens of the camera and also for the lens and it was under 8 bucks so really cheap. So let me show you how easy it is. Welcome in the studio guys, I am Flash and sorry for my neighbors but I need to install this screen protector very fast because I need to go out and shoot a motovlog so let's not waste any more time, don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button and start unboxing this thing. This is a screen protector set for the Action 3 but it will also fit the Action 4, it was really cheap and it contains two protectors for every part of the camera that is exposed so let me open this. And here it is. This kit also came with some dust absorber and some cleaning wipes. Two sets of them which is uh, really nice because they are for two cameras or for replacement if you need to replace one after you break it. So yeah, pretty nice. So I pulled out everything I need. Here is a glass for the front screen, back screen and the lens. But I will not use this lens protector because it will degrade the image quality but if you want you can do it. DJ sells this front element at a really great price and I never broke any lens on any action camera that I've got so if it will break I will take the risk and I will buy another lens from DJI. You can keep it for some desert action if you go in the desert and shoot there where is a lot of sand and it is more prone to scratch. So this will go back and now I will have this case prepared for the next time when I need to install another screen protector on my DJI Action 4. The first thing we should do is to open the cleaning pouch which contains an alcohol pad, cloth and dust absorbers. I also have close to me a dust blower because it is the best thing when it comes to dust removal and if you are a photographer I am sure that you have a blower like this in your camera kit so yeah pretty nice. Since my camera is brand new I will not use the alcohol pad because uh, the cloth is enough. I don't have a lot of grease on my screen so I will start with the screen uh, in front of the camera and after I will clean it very well and there isn't any dust speck on it. One more here. Now I am ready to install the front screen protector. Peel back the protection film. Then it needs to be aligned pretty well and you drop it on the screen and this should be it. You press one corner, no bubbles, no nothing, installation complete. Beautiful. The most important thing is not to touch the glue side after it was exposed and also do not let any dust or debris get under it before you apply it on the screen. I would advise you to try to move as fast as you can, don't talk, don't breathe towards the camera and you should be fine. And as you can see I didn't use any of the dust uh, stickers because they sometimes leave some residue and it is a pain to clean after and you didn't resolve anything. So better use a clean cloth and a blower. And now we are ready to move on the back side. Again the same cloth and wipe the screen. It looks pretty clean but be aware on the bigger screen you have more chances to catch some dust under the protector so be careful. One very good trick is to turn around and blow the screen protector because after you have put it on the desk for sure it has some dust particles on it so get rid of everything. One more blow and we are ready to peel this off and align it and it should go 
very nice. I don't know if this can be seen on the camera, but I've got some dust particles on the side here, but it should not affect the screen quality since it is over the black part of the screen. And this is it guys, the camera is fully protected and I am ready to go and mount it on my helmet. I really wanted to do this before going out and motovlogging because on my motovlogging setup the camera is rubbing against my helmet and better protect it before scratching it. So now the Action 4 is fully protected minus the lens because I told you I will not degrade my image quality and I hope this video was helpful to you and saved you some money in the long run. If you missed the unboxing of the Action 4 camera don't hesitate to go and watch it because it was pretty cool and until next time have fun filming with your new Action 4 camera and see you soon. Flash out!